Peace, everyone. Peace. Welcome back to the channel. Today is going to be another lovely lock video. Part two. Part two, cleanse, deep cleanse. And we switched it up a little bit today. Yeah, this time instead of doing an apple cider vinegar rinse, we're dun, gonna dun, be dun. using a bomb. We got a deep cleanse bath bomb from Dreads UK. Thanks Dreads UK. We've never used one of these before, so I'm excited yeah. to see how it works. You all know we have this handy dandy, handy dandy. inflatable shampoo station. Yeah. And I'll link that below if any of you need one of those because it really comes in handy, Super handy. for hair soaks. So uh, let's get started. We put a tarp down this time because last time we got the carpet way too wet. Now he's washing it, so the water's starting to run clear. Bomb really worked. Woo! All right, so his hair is nice and clean. Mmm, smells like nag champa and coconut. Yeah. And I am going to go through it and remove any knots and mats and retwist it up and have him looking nice and clean. So as always, I am using some aloe vera gel. This is just straight 100% organic aloe vera. I don't want to use anything else because I don't want him to have product buildup. So we're gonna start by using, start in the back right here. See where all of that is tangled together? I'm gonna untangle all of that. Some progress. Okay, having four hands instead of two is very helpful. Thank you for being a friend. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> God, Thank you for being my friend. Yeah. <laughs> you, you. Look at all that forehead. That's a whole five head right there. I don't have dreams. I have movies and sequels. How you feeling? Like my brains are tied up. <laughs> we are all done. Probably could see it better here. There we go. All clean. All twisted up. Smelling nice. Smelling nice like coconut. 
Looking good, baby. Yeah, bye. And I just gotta dry it up. And now for the blow dryer. Don't get too close on the on the six on the six. Right? You look beautiful. Shout out to moms for coming through and helping out with the extra hand. Made the time go by way faster. Yeah, got your boy styling right now. Every time I roll up, homies how to hold up. Then I tell them roll up. You ain't getting by that you ain't smoking and I've been joke. You wanna use your in joke. Someone tell this man to calm down. This is day two. The day after we did what it do. Let's see how it held up. Let's see how it held up. Okay. Okay, it's not as tight as last time, I will say, and I'm not even mad at that. I am not even mad at that. You know, because I don't like my brains to be tied up, how they be tied up when they be tied up. Mm-hmm. Let's take this off. I love it when it's clean like that, and they're just super shiny and black. Smell good. Mmm. Smash or pass. Smash or pass, ladies. Smash or pass. Good job, baby. I appreciate it. I know it's not easy. You got anything to say to the people before we out of here? Thanks for watching the video and you should like and subscribe because we post a lot of cool videos that I know you want to see and we're going to post more dreadlock videos as time goes on. Yeah. And, and we need help finding good products. So comment below if you know of any natural products for dreadlocks especially if they're black owned yes every time we're looking for products online like we love the bucks county soap um and we love the bath bomb but those are both white owned dreadlock companies and we would love to support black owned dreadlock companies that are creating products that are natural so Comment below if you know of any. Yeah, how about that? Please know that, yes, we know that white and black are disparaging terms and nobody is actually black or white, but it's just to keep up with the, uh, what do they call it? The lingua, lingua franca of, so people know what we're talking about, but nobody's actually white or black. We know this, okay? So don't come for us. Yeah, we're infinite beings. You heard? Signing out everyone, thanks for watching. See you next time, peace.